Hi guys, it's Danielle and I am here. I am sitting on the floor of my um, makeup room essentially and I'm coming to you with my VIB Rouge sale haul. Um, I did two things. I shopped online and then I went into store. So I have quite a bit of things. I'll show you what I got in store first because that's technically what I had in my hand. But let me just say that the shipping was amazingly fast. Um, I ordered, I made, placed my order at like 6 o'clock Friday morning when the sale started and I had my order in my possession, ooh, I want to say Saturday afternoon. So I'm filming on my iPhone so I'm going to be looking, I don't know how I'm looking, whatever. <laughs> Sorry guys. So in store I got the um, Glow Recipe Watermelon Glow Sleeping Mask. It smells like legit watermelon. Um, and it's got like um, a very jelly-like consistency. I've used it twice. Um, I don't know if it's done really too much for my skin, but I like it. I got a backup of my Kat Von D Locket Tattoo uh, eyeliner in Trooper. And then I picked up the Marc Jacobs Snake Charmers um, High Gloss Lip Lacquer set. So I have everyone in here except for... Um, Sugar Sugar, which is a top selling one. I have it on my lips from earlier today. Um, I really do like these a lot for lip glosses. Um, sorry. No, I'm gonna do this. I don't know. I guess I'll go back up them. Uh, we'll figure this out together. Um, so on my online order, I made, I got two of the um, Beauty Blender Solid Brush Cleansers. I really do like these. These get my makeup brushes and sponges super clean. I ordered the Marc Jacobs Decadence perfume. It's cute. It looks like a little handbag. Um, the smell is deep. It's um, a fancy smell, I guess. I don't know. Um, the Glam Glow Glow Starter in New Glow. This is the daytime moisturizer I use. It doesn't have SPF in it, but it has a nice subtle sheen to it. The Farsali Unicorn Essence Skin Enhancing Antioxidant Serum. This is what I use as my daytime serum. It's light pink um, and smells very much like candy. Then I ordered a backup of my Dior Show Pump and Show uh, Pump and Volume Pump and Volume mascara, and this is actually a little kit. So it comes with the mascara in here, and I believe I've shown this. My husband bought me my original tube of this when we were in Paris. And looks like this. It's got like a squeezy tube, so you can get more product on there. I love this mascara. It's not waterproof, um, and I'm working on a couple samples right now, so I'm gonna wait to open that. And then it came with this little itty bitty um, eyeshadow compact with like warm toned colors, which is really cute. So, and it was the same price as the mascara. Obviously, everything here I got 20% off of it because of the sale. Then, they threw in a freebie. It's a 100 point perk right now, from what I see, is um, Star Woman by NARS. It's one of their Power Matte Lip Pigments. It's red. I don't know if it's because I renewed my rouge. I also got a foundation brush, but it's nothing especially crazy. And then I got a bunch of Fenty Beauty stuff. I already have the foundation and the primer, as you can see up there, but then I also got the, whoops, the Travel Touch Up Brush, which I've already used, tiny, and goes away like that. The, um, no, that's not what I want to show you. The Invisible, the Universal Invisimat Blotting Powder, which has a pink tint to it. I don't know if you can see that iridescence on there, but I love that. Um, so that's the powder. Use it. Um, I do get oily with the Fenty foundation. I'm not wearing it today. I am a little bit shiny right now, but I'm using the Urban Decay Naked Skin because I'm trying to use that up. I also got the um, Kilowatt Freestyle Highlighter in... Lightning Dust and Fire Crystal. I love this. Uh, obviously, Lightning Dust is a little bit more natural than Fire Crystal. Fire Crystal's got all them sparkles in it, which is like super exciting. And then the last thing I got 
is a matchsticks trio in light. So it comes with linen as the conceal shade. It is a little bit too creamy. My under eyes creased a lot with that. Amber, the contour shade, which I really like. And Starstruck is the um, cream highlight shade, which is really pretty. So I'm very happy with my haul. I requalified for Rouge. Next year is a big year. Um, you know, 2018, so I've got a lot of projects going on. So I might be joining in on like the reverse rouge next year, trying not to spend, trying to like get rid of a thousand dollars worth of products or use, not getting rid of, using up a thousand dollars worth of products, but we'll see how that goes. Um, I have another video that's going to be coming out like uh, very shortly after this one um, about a project I'm working on. That's why it's also a big year. So I will talk to you guys later. Bye.